What up, players? It's War Boss Tay up in this mud. I don't even know where to begin. I finished building my terrain piece here, the Manufactorum. I added some sandbags that I got off of eBay for very cheap, and I've got a bunch of stuff that I'm going to use to gussy it up with. So let's take a look. Here we have some, what company is this? Pegasus Industries oil drums, which I'm going to put on the the wooden base. Speaking of the wooden base, I got this one foot by one foot wooden base from a hobby company that specializes in railroad and derby uh, boxcars kind of thing. <clears throat> and uh, it was really helpful because I know Idig Beer's terrain competition is a 12 inch by 12 inch, so the hardwood base is going to be really good. Got some Gale Force 9 cables and chains, which I'm going to use to decorate the insides of this thing. I've got some secret weapons. Uh, barbed wire, which is really good. It's my favorite preferred barbed wire now, having tried a bunch of different companies. So I'm going to add, be adding that to the, the piece. And I've got some secret weapon miniatures, master class shell casings, which I'm going to snip out and decorate all over the place. So let me get these pieces out of the way and I'll show you really quickly what uh, I decided to build. Also, I've got these eye beams which we're going to use for big metal uh, beams sticking out of the ground and um, debris, battlefield debris and whatnot. So I built this piece thinking that it would be like one half of a bombed out, shelled out building. And that, like I said in my intro video, it's going to be the last stand for a group of Imperial Guardsmen who are making their kind of like Alamo last stand. So they've kind of fortified the place and I've also built up a little... I snipped off the Katachin Command Sprue flag and added a brass rod to it so I might be placing it somewhere on, on, the, on the terrain piece. Um, I've clipped out a spare heavy stubber from a tank and I'm gonna try to make it look like it's broken or leaning on a piece of the scenery and I'm gonna also see if I can creatively convert some Cadians to look like they're slumped over dead bodies kind of thing or what I might do is also put the weapon like on the side like this like it was about to be set up but uh, they didn't have enough time to set it up before they were overrun so I'm gonna have um, spare las guns lying around, equipment packs, try to put bodies here and there, and uh, still make it a usable terrain piece with lots of extra room. Uh, here's a creative workaround that I thought was pretty cool. There wasn't enough floor pieces to connect all the way, so I thought a cool little way to get to this little section of the base would be to use one of the doors. So I snipped out the door and I used it as a bridge, and we're gonna put like barbed wire around here and all sorts of different stuff. Um, I'm going to be using the Death Corps of Krieg transfer sheet to do a lot of, hopefully, like uh, road signs and whatnot. You might have seen from their uh, different videos on the Death Corps of Krieg that they have like minefield markings. So I might decorate some like minefields in front. The, the goal is to make this look like an imperial sector street. So um, like a roadway, maybe street signs or something, or, or just rubble. And to help with the rubble, I've also got this from Woodland Scenics, lightweight hydrocal casting plaster. Oops. Uh, yeah, so the casting plaster is going to go onto these Woodland Scenics um, rock tray makers mold molds. So I'm gonna mix those up and pop out some rocks. I'm gonna paint the base, put the rocks on, glue some gravel and ballast, and make it look like a street. So uh, just showing you these different components before I get started. I've got a couple days left before uh, Nick's competition ends at the end of the month. So looking forward to that. And uh, yeah, altogether I'm very excited about this project. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And uh, let me know what you think of my overrun Imperial fortification for Idic Beer's March terrain competition. Thanks for watching you guys, hope you all are doing well and we'll see you in the next video. Laters players!